What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're doing something a little different and what we're going to be doing is talking about the Unigear ski boot bag that I've been using for the past month or so. So let's jump right into it. So before I tell you the details of the bag and what I've experienced, I want to tell you how I got it and what's going on here. So Unigear reached out to me a few months ago and asked if I wanted to review one of their products and they sent me the bag after talking for a bit and I've just been using it since the ski season started, brought it up to Big Snow and Mountain Creek a few times, haven't had the opportunity to really use it like hiking anywhere, but for the most part I've got a good idea of what's going on here and they haven't paid me to say anything good. They sent me the bag and said, we want your honest review, we think it's a good product, but we're not paying you. I'm not getting paid by the way, but they weren't paying me to say good things about it. I'm just here to tell you guys what I've found with this bag and tell you a little bit about it and what I think of it. So. Let's talk about it. So this is the 50 liter Unigear ski boot bag. It's a backpack with straps, um, and the biggest feature of the bag is to be able to carry your boots, helmet, goggles, pretty much everything you need in one bag. And I'll be honest, I was a bit skeptical when I got it because I'm a size 10 and a half boot. I ride a snowboard by the way, in case you're new here. And 10 and a half snowboard boots are pretty big. I mean, I don't know what ski boots are like. I mean, I have a general idea, but I don't know exactly how they'd fit into a bag like this, but snowboard boots fit well. So let me show you how they fit in here. So you unzip this back, which is sick, and this folds down. So if you're somewhere you can just stand on it, I've actually had to use it when it was snowing at Creek a few weeks ago. And boots fit right in the back. Got both boots in there. And you can honestly fit some other things in there if you need to throw them in as well. So. That's a solid feature and they fit with plenty of room. I'd say you could probably fit up to a size 13 boot in there. So yeah, that's a solid feature. Has the clasp on the backpack straps in case you want to snap them together. Next big thing is on the top, you have this section to just put all of your gear. This is where I keep my gloves, my beanies, wherever I need. So I have both my gloves up here. Got my goggles in their case. And I've got my face mask and I have plenty of room in there to fit whatever else I need, to be honest. Even with the boots in there, plenty of room. Then over here, got front zips. This is where I keep all my GoPro stuff. I don't have my GoPro stuff in there right now, but again, another really large pocket to fit things in. Plenty of space. You also have this inner zipper here in case you want to really not lose stuff. Where you can keep small things like cards, credit cards, Pencils, I don't know why you need a pencil. Probably wax, that would make more sense. You also have this strap up front, which can carry things. I have a uh, past big snow in there, which I'm actually gonna put in the zipper pocket now, because that's much safer. And I just noticed it. I'd say the other biggest feature about this bag, which I really like, is it has these straps on the back, up top, and down here. And you could definitely fit either your snowboard or your skis on the back unstrap it, put it on, strap it in top and bottom, and then tighten it down. That'll be really great for if you're hiking anywhere, if you're just, like, you don't have a split board and you're just hiking, I don't know, your local park and you wanna throw your board on the back, hike up to the top and snowboard down, that's a perfect option for that. So let me throw everything back in and I'll give you my honest review of the bag. Also, before I do that honest review, I just want to say I like to keep my helmet strapped to the side. That's just how I like it. I could definitely fit it inside up top if I wanted to, but I don't know. I like it there. So, actual review of this bag. When I was contacted by Unigear and they told me about this bag, this is something I thought I would never purchase for myself because I didn't see the necessity. But now that I've had it, it's honestly made like the whole process of going snowboarding so much easier. Boots fit in there, my goggles fit in there, my gloves fit in there, my helmet strapped on. Pretty much everything I would need, I could just keep in this bag and not forget it. And it's also all in one place. I don't have to scramble among the trunk of my car to try and find my gloves. Instead, I just know they're in the bag. And it's honestly just so much easier. And I didn't realize how much easier it would be before I started using it. So. I would definitely recommend that if you're a skier or a snowboarder that you buy this bag. Like this is my honest opinion by the way, I'm not being paid to say any of this. I would recommend buying this bag. What I was using before, I was just using a snowboard boot bag to keep my boots in and that was it. 
everything else I just either throw in a backpack or just toss into my car and that honestly got really messy and unorganized very fast but with the bag it just makes my life so much easier yeah that's pretty much it really sounds like I'm trying to sell this bag but I'm not I'm just trying to say that if you want something to transport your gear this is a cheap option that works really well and I'd highly recommend it so, one other thing I'm actually gonna be working with Uni Gear to do a giveaway on my Instagram pretty soon. So make sure to go follow my Instagram at Snowskate Shred and keep your eyes peeled for a post about a goggle giveaway with Uni Gear. And that'll be coming up really soon and we'll be giving away a pair of goggles to someone. First time giveaway on the channel, kind of a thank you for 500 subscribers and works out perfectly. So. With that in mind, I'm trying to hit a thousand subscribers before the end of this winter. So make sure you subscribe if you're enjoying my content. I'm putting out daily videos and I'm trying to reach my goal and I'm super psyched to be halfway there and I really think we can do it. So if you're enjoying the videos, make sure to subscribe for me. I think that's about it. This bag's great, something different for you guys. And I hope that if you are in the market for something like this, purchase one of these. You can find the link for it in my description. And yeah, that's it. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like, comment something interesting, and subscribe if you're new here. Thanks for watching. Peace!